Antique 182 because it makes its global debut here at Fort Lauderdale Boat Show. So the 182 is actually the gross tonnage and not the length. And this is because they wanted to emphasise the width and not just the length of this boat. It really is the most attractive 90 foot yacht out there. The detail on this boat is unreal and it's a real credit to British boat building. So it's a sister ship to the Ocean 90 um, and the first thing I noticed when I stepped on board was the hydraulic platform which has a totally unique foldaway sun lounge out. Um, the beach club is unreal, you can create such an awesome beach environment, it's got barbecue, it's got sun lounges um, and then as you step up the stairs it's got some custom loose furniture so you can really make the space your own in any way you like. Um, it's got loads of storage so again they are really thinking of every detail. So Sunseek has never built a boat before with only one helm but this is driven by feedback specifically from the US market. So as you look through the main salon you can see straight through and straight forward um, and you can see straight through to the slightly raised dining area which is such a lovely design idea because you get an awesome view whilst dining and entertaining. Um, so awesome crew access with four berths and two cabins with the OMS. The crew can easily move through the boat without disturbing anyone or the owner. So as you walk through the boat, what I really noticed was the height was awesome. So I was walking next to someone that was six foot two and it was still so spacious. Um, the designer staircase, wow, the spiral design of that looks unreal. Um, it's got a fully equipped galley, um, noticed a lovely little wine cooler too which looked lovely. Um, but upstairs, that's where the magic happens. So the pure size and volume, which is where you build up to that 182, so much volume up there. So you've got um, like a real sort of living, cosy space, uh, which can be enclosed, closed off, air conditioned. So if you want to get some sun, you can step, step out and do that. If you want to close it in and have an evening, um, you know, on a lovely deep sofa to lounge and watch TV or watch the ocean go by, because there's plenty of eye level windows. So flexibility downstairs by the cabins, so if you want to put a washer dryer in there instead of a cupboard then that's all doable with the Sunseeker design team. Um, and then the two twin cabins that come together as doubles electronically if you'd like that as well. Um, as I went through to the VIP cabin, oh my goodness, it was so wide and that's due to the unique bow shape, again adding to that 182. So powered by uh, twin man engines, um, it's got a huge tank, centrally located holding 13,000 gallons of fuel. So this enclosed flybridge really is a huge hit for the US market. Um, the outside deck area as well as we walked through was really, really spacious. Huge sun pads with parasol options, drinks on hand, and the fridge right next to you as well. So it's not a super yacht, but it behaves exactly like one. So honestly, if you get the chance to check it out at the show, I 100% would recommend. See you soon.